We caught up with members of the 109th Family Support Group at this grocery store in Honesdale. We're buying boxes of tissues to keep on hand for the families. Um, everybody will be crying out of happiness. They're also reminding customers here to welcome the soldiers. Soldiers are coming home. Yeah. After should, seven. After seven. So get out and line the streets. The bus will be rolling. <laughs> Back at the armory in Honesdale, the phone has been ringing off the hook. Up and you'll see where it'll end. There'll be a, a big banner at the bottom. We'll see you tonight. Bye bye. The main hall where soldiers will gather is decorated with flags and posters. This one in particular holds a special place in everybody's heart. One of the soldiers in Iraq drew this, sent it home to us, and then I have a friend that drew this on here and we painted it so the guys could see it. The family support group took it to the next level and printed the artwork on t-shirts and sent them to Iraq. Tan color was chosen to match the soldier's uniform. Another big project for the volunteers, packing goodie bags to welcome the troops. What do you call these bags? Uh, an American meal for American heroes. This is what's going to hold um, baseball. Mm -hmm. um, they're going to have a hot dog. Oh, I and our apple pies, yes, and the Chevrolet. A celebration almost a week in the making that for many here may be the event of the year. Rosa Yum News Watch 16, Honesdale.